This is your number one source for urban entertainment. This is the Juice Network. I am your boy, Tariq Dewey. We out here at the Out the Mud Music Festival out here in Salt River, North Carolina. And I got two, not just one, but I got two. Yo, very, yo. very special guest. I want you guys to introduce yourself, let the people know where you're from and all that good stuff. Hey, yo, it's Coach Jay, and this is Coach Put Him In, you feel me? Straight from St. Louis, man. You know what I'm saying? Living in Houston, Texas. You know, I'm just trying to come out here, bro. North Carolina, we're getting it out the mud, you hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Rambo. Making easy money, putting holes in style from Memphis, Tennessee. You know what I'm saying? Oh. All right, so I got two special guests here. So you being from St. Louis, right, and you being from Memphis, right, just talk about uh, what it's like coming to North Carolina and just seeing all the musical talent that's out here, all the connections that's being made and stuff like that. Like, what's it like being out here, you know, getting your music out here? Man, this shit different. Coming from uh, Memphis, like, there's a lot of shit going on in Memphis, especially on the music scene, bro. To see, like, the different scenarios going on in Charlotte and just Carolina and the, all the talent in Carolina, bro, this shit different, bro. There's a lot of love, bro. Y'all welcome me into space and some shit. They're like, if we got good music, y'all fuck with it, bro, no matter where you from, bro. Exactly. And, I, and I appreciate that shit a lot. Yeah, bro. What I what I noticed off real, bro, in NC, bro, is that y'all got like a different sound. You know what I'm saying? Y'all got y'all own sound, bro. And I, I fuck with that. You know, that's why I like traveling as much as I do because I get a little ear about everything that everybody got to offer, bro. Being from St. Louis, we got a different way. Him being from Memphis, they got a different way. Facts. North Carolina, y'all got a different way, bro. So it's like you know, it is what it is. But you know, I definitely appreciate it because I did something that I take. And I wrap up, and you know what I'm saying? I might have to get on a little North Carolina beat, you know what I'm saying? Hey, 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 you know, just a pin, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, I, that's what I fuck with more than anything. It's just look here, everybody, bro, and enjoying the talent, bro. All right, so, you know, so let's talk about talent, you know, and, and music, right? So, start from day one. Where did it start? Where did music start for y'all? Man, bro, I've been rapping since I was a little kid, for real, for real. To be honest, I didn't really like rapping because my pops was trying to rap. Ah. And so, like, he never really got it. He never really got it. He never really got to where he was going. And so uh, that always demotivated me. I'm like, bro, it ain't nothing in that rap shit for real. Mm. And I was just like, bro, fuck it, bro. He really motivated me. He was like, shit, you really trying to do this rap shit? I said, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? Shit, we both gifted with the shit. We both got talent. So I'm like, you know, that's what it is, nigga. So, you know. I got shit in my hair, bro. But anyways, bro. Yeah. Man, for real, bro, I've been freestyling for the longest, bro, but I was like, man, I, I, we both played football, so you know what I'm saying? Football, we was on the field, you know what I'm saying? And even when I was trying to rap and do shit, bro, all the niggas was rapping and doing all that, they were like, bro, you got talent on the field, so, like, keep it, you know what I'm saying? Keep it, focus on that one thing. But the goal, the older I got, bro, and the shit, I can put myself in different situations to make, you know what I'm saying, to make what I need to happen, bro, people like, hey, like, you really can rap. And I'm like, all right, bro, well, I'm finna record some shit. And I record the first thing I recorded, and he was like, oh, yeah, this shit, this shit hard. So I'm like, bro, I'm gonna keep it going, and we gonna see what happens. All right, so being out here, you know, at this event, at the Out the Mud event, right, what has it been like, you know, just seeing, you know, people like receive you guys, your sound, your music, and uh, what's the long-term goal for y'all in, in the music industry? A uh, long term goal, shit. I don't even know to be honest. I really uh on a on a, on a free trial right now. Cause hey, 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 no on a free trial. Hey, 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 I, I, I'm on a free trial, man. So, bro, we just gonna see where this shit take us. You know what I'm saying? That's all it is, bro. All I know is, bro, we hard as fuck. So I know when you got talent, bro. Talent plus hard work equals greatness. You know Absolutely. what I'm saying? So, ah, right, we gonna trust in God and we gonna see where He take us. Absolutely. I mean, like my boy said, really, it's just God's plan, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, my thing is, you know, it's free. You know what I'm saying? To just go ahead and put your content out. And if somebody fucking with it, it might blow. You know what I'm saying? If not, you know what I'm saying? You still did it. You still got something to put on it that you put on this earth. You know what I'm saying? That people can go back and listen to and, and fuck with you and vibe with you if you're really talking about some real nigga shit. And at the end of the day, like, real shit lasts. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you putting out real shit, that's what it is, bro. But, like... This honestly is my first performance, so you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just excited to see where it go, you know what I'm saying? Because, man, like, I feel like we rocked that bitch. I know we rocked that bitch, so you know right. what I'm saying? So, you know, we should have really got on the big stage. I, I ain't really know what's going to be like that, you know what I'm saying? We should have we got on the big stage, really rocked this whole out, but you know, you know, we it's a learning experience, bro. Like I said, shit, we really just started 
taking the shit serious like two, three months ago. So, you know, it is what it is. But like I said, bro, this is God's plan, bro. And we're going to see where it go, bro. Like, Coach put him in. Coach Jay on Instagram. You know, we good, bro. Rambo. D underscore Rambo one on everything, Twitter, Instagram, your mom for now, I'm just playing. Hey, but nah, we, we appreciate this, bro. You know what I'm saying? We going to keep it rocking. Even though I had some shit in my hair like Mike Pence. <laughs> hey, bro, listen. Shit, we going to keep it.